What's going on, bro? Your man, she cannot hurt you. Hey, my name is David Jones. Welcome to my YouTube channel where I talk about masculine topics and things that affect men and that will prayerfully and hopefully uplift men. There's been so much content over the last few years about the red pill or the pink pill or this pill or that pill. But I think a lot of those uh, pieces of content, although there are some helpful gems or helpful advice, a lot of them, when it comes to men, I think a lot of that content misses the mark for this reason. You're man and you're tough strong, you're logical, you're rational. And a lot of this content encourages men to step away from their masculinity and become these individuals who are more feeling centric rather than thinking centric. And when you're feeling centric as a man, here's one thing that can happen you will begin to overstate emotionally the threat that you face from something or from someone. Particularly if you're dealing with marriage, I've been married for 10 years now. I've gone through this, getting way too emotional about maybe my wife being emotional. She's a woman, it's more natural for her to operate from that perspective that may not always understand and I'm learning to empathize but that doesn't mean that I have to uh, match her emotionality it doesn't serve me I don't feel better going through that I feel more disconnected I feel more ungrounded but when I think through things and I say you know what she may have just said something to me have done something to me in a tone that I don't appreciate, but that's not the same thing as saying that she's hurt me. She cannot hurt me. I know that that their her intentions are well, but her style of communication is different than mine. Her style of processing through things is different than mine. A good book that you can read that I think will be helpful to you if you're struggling with this is called Love and Respect. I encourage you to go check it out. This book details some of the differences between how men and women communicate and how we process through the world and through life. I made a post the other day that said, if we're talking about emotional problems or having an emotional perspective can be helpful. But a lot of problems that you'll face as a man are thinking problems, problems of the mind and not problems of feelings. So we're talking about if you want to become more fit, although there is an emotional aspect, there's a much more powerful thinking aspect in place. That thinking aspect is being disciplined, saying I'm going to eat a certain way and I'm going to move my body a certain amount and in certain ways, whether it's weightlifting, or cardio, or whatever it is that you're going to do boxing, whatever, you're going to use your thinking faculties to be disciplined. You want to put your thoughts in charge of your emotions, your thinking in charge of your emotions. That's more useful to you. If it comes to earning money, well, you've been doing the same thing to earn money for a long time. Well, you can feel a way about it and say, you know what? It's in fair to sit right. Or you can think about it and say, you know what? What can I do differently? to bring the financial increase into my life that I desire. Your emotions can't really hurt you. You can allow them to be detriments in your life or to deter you from doing things, but they can't really hurt you. You're in control of them. They can't hurt you. She can't hurt you. Only you decide how you're going to live and how you're going to project and what you're going to allow to affect you in adverse ways. Anyway, I want to keep this video short. I appreciate you. Again, my name is David Jones. 
take a moment to like this video, subscribe to this channel, and share this with another man that you think could find value from content like this.